Monterey's Custom House Plaza is losing an iconic feature. Its fountain will be taken out. Action News reporter Caitlin Conrad is live in Monterey right now to tell us why. Dan, the city wants to start demolition on the fountain on Thursday. The plan is to make more room for events that are frequently held there in the plaza. The electrical, from what I understand, is all of these boxes that we have here, all these um, separate entities here are, are power. The fountain at Custom House Plaza takes up a lot of space, and it hasn't had water running through it in more than a decade. So Monterey has made the big decision to remove it. It, it is because it has a lot of historical significance to a lot of people, a lot of memories associated with it. But uh, the time for that fountain has come to an end, and it's time to move on to a bigger, brighter future for the plaza. Once it is gone, there will be more room in the plaza, which is frequently in use for festivals. And the neighboring Portola Hotel and Spa says this is a good thing. All the festivals that are out there that um, happen throughout the year, there's challenges in terms of trying to set it up and maximize that space. Once the fountain is gone, a temporary pavilion will be set up in its place to help accommodate events, while the conference center undergoes renovations. But a permanent plan hasn't been decided. Steve Wintry with the city says what is certain is that it likely won't be a feature that needs water. He says like the grass that's been let go on the plaza steps, the future of many Monterey landscaping projects looks dry. The area has been in a, uh, a situation where it's trying to conserve its water use for quite some time. Um, it has been about 10 years since the fountain was operational, um, and it is part of that, that picture of water conservation. Removing the fountain is going to be a big project. It's connected to the top of Lighthouse Tunnel. So they're going to have to close the tunnel next week. It'll happen on the night of the 16th through the morning hours of the 17th um, there in Monterey. Dan. All right. Thanks very much, Caitlin. They also say that while they're actually doing that part of the tunnel, there's some other repairs that they wanted to do in there as well. They'll get to those at the same time.